firstly, it's been very well organized, uh, as I indicated earlier. Uh, we, thank Com we thank Interpol for inviting us to be part of this, to be exposed to the international arena with regard to each one, each role player that's combating counterfeiting and piracy. We know it's a problem, it's not isolated, and by hearing the challenges that's been experienced uh, in other countries, and we could detect that it's the same that's been experienced in our country, and even where you could interact with different uh, uh, representatives, uh, where their best practices, uh, where you could learn to see this is how you could deal where you are dealing with similar problems in, in, in our country. So, in a nutshell, uh, we're grateful to be part of this. We uh, would appreciate if we in future could consistently be included in such a platform where we can enrich what we busy with and interact with the different role players to successfully combat intellectual property crime. One example is I've met with uh, one of the, the brand holders from the private sector, from Bayersdorf, which gave us value information, intelligence, with suspected uh, cargoes that's coming to South Africa, so I had to sensitize them just to follow up certain information. Uh, so on my return, definitely I already have been tasked to deal with a certain thing, and it's an international which involves South Africa, Germany, China. And so looking forward to look uh, to be part and to show that South Africa is on board. South Africa want to work with the other countries, South Africa want to work with Interpol because in the end we have the same objective and we have to put hands together to curb this crime.